ESP is a platform that enables business owners to automate their business processes in an extremely short period of time, with an emphasis on it being a user-friendly system. ESP is great for organizations that are looking to automate their operations quickly without having to rely on IT service providers who will spend a lot of time and cost a lot of money to develop custom systems that meet their exact needs. So let's have a look at how easy it is to create processes on ESP and how easy it is to use the system. So here I'm logged in as the organization's administrator. I'll show you how easy it is to actually create a process. So we're going to add a service. We'll give a brief description of the service. We'll link it to a predefined category that I've already created as the administrator. I'll just add a logo. And here I've defined my process. I'll go to stages. Before I add stages, I can easily create the form that is going to be filled by the applicant. Mark that as mandatory. And here I've actually created my form. I'm going to add my first stage. And in that stage, I'm going to add the acceptance criteria, which is assigned to the approver who's going to be checking this request. So this is one stage created. I'll make this as a two stage process. Here I've created my second stage. I'm saving my changes. And then we will just publish the process. So this is how an admin can create um, a process for expense claims. So ESP can be accessed by applicants either through the mobile application or through the web. And I'm basically going to land on my open applications or the history of all my applications. I'm going to show you how easy it is to create one or to submit one. I'll go to add applications. I can basically filter based on category. I've got two categories. I'll go to employee. On there, I'll see expense claims, which is this, which is the process that we just created. I'll add the amount. I'll attach the invoice, and then I'll just submit. So that will show that it's actually pending. So once they've accessed the system, they will land on MySpace, and on there, they're going to see the history of all the applications that are pending their action. And they can also see a history of all the ones that they've actually approved or rejected previously. So this is the one that the employee has just submitted. They'll be able to review the application. So this is the claim amount, the attachment. They'll be able to approve or reject. So I'm just going to approve it. So this stage is completed and then it will move to the next stage, which is the HR approval. They will approve or reject. They can add a comment. The applicant will now be notified that there is an update to the status of their application. So again, we're switching back to the mobile. And here you'll see that the application has actually been accepted through the mobile application, obviously through the web. So this was just a very quick tour for you to see how easy it is to use ESP, how to set up um, the organization, how to create processes in literally one to two minutes. So thank you.